Hi, I'm your car's powerhouse and my name is Battery. How about going on a long drive to know more about me? My job is to supply power to the starter and ignition system to start the engine. Even when the car is running, I supply the extra power needed when the vehicle's electrical load exceeds the supply from the charging system. I also act as a voltage stabilizer in the electrical system. The battery also evens out voltage spikes and prevents them from damaging other components in the electrical system. I share a great chemistry with the car or for that matter any vehicle or gadget. Allow me to explain this with the help of some um, chemistry and physics, okay? Well, a battery can be any device that stores energy for later use. However, common use of the word battery is limited to an electrochemical device that converts chemical energy into electricity. Actually, a battery is one or more galvanic cells connected in series or in parallel, just like the series of bulbs that light up our festivals. Basically, I am of two types. A primary battery which is designed to be fully discharged only once and then discarded. And a secondary battery which is commonly known as a rechargeable battery. It is usually designed to have a lifetime of between 100 and 1000 recharge cycles depending on the composite materials. <laughs> Big talks for a small battery like me, you may think. Not really. Let me show you how this small thing powers your big car or any other vehicle. I have positive and negative lead plates that sit in a liquid called electrolyte solution, which is a mixture of water and sulfuric acid. When this solution interacts with the lead plates, a chemical reaction takes place. This chemical reaction creates pressure that you call voltage. The voltage pushes the current out of the battery's negative terminal through the load, that is the equipment drawing the power. The current returns through the positive terminal. This is how I charge your car and recharge myself. Ah, that reminds me of Mr. Sharma who visited a Tata Green outlet with some battery trouble. Just a few days back, Mr. Sharma visited a Tata Green franchise with some battery trouble. He explains the problem to the franchisee, who instructs his mechanic to check the battery. The technician understands his problem and then opens the car bonnet to check the battery. He has the necessary tools ready, puts the fender cover and wears the gloves. He then checks the state of charge and specific gravity with a hydrometer. He checks the specific gravity reading of each cell. A hydrometer measures the exact weight of electrolyte with that of water. A strong electrolyte in a charged battery is heavier than a weak electrolyte in a discharged battery. Then the mechanic checks the health of the battery using a battery tester. He's saying that the battery is old and the cell voltage is below the required voltage. Let's see what he prescribes. Ah, a replacement. 
The smile on Mr. Sharma's face says that he is proud to be the owner of a Tata Green battery. Your new battery has got it right. So, switch off the ignition while he applies Vaseline to the battery terminals and to the bolts of the battery holder. Do you know Mr. Sharma is proud to own me now? And I am happy to serve him. That was a quick job. Mr. Sharma and his car are ready to zip through the congested city roads or go on a long drive with the Tata green battery under the bonnet, promising him good company always. After all, it's the Tata reputation that stays with him.